Sir Lewis Hamilton heads home for this weekend's British Grand Prix, his last for Mercedes, knowing his car is a winner in the hands of his teammate George Russell at the last race in Austria. And while the 39-year-old heads home as the most successful Grand Prix driver of all time, and the most successful at the iconic Silverstone circuit with eight wins. Success has been slim in recent years, with his last title in 2020, his last win at 2021 Saudi Arabian Grand Prix, and his last race in Austria a pretty shocking run to fourth place. Though this year's Spanish Grand Prix proved to be a breakthrough, with Hamilton earning his first podium since Mexico last year. It's a step in the right direction, providing hope that he can secure a final win with Mercedes this year before putting on the red suit. All on the back of the squad's upgrades, starting from Canada, where it introduced a new front wing. It delivered more performance, it made the car feel uh, easy to drive, uh, well balanced, and, and made the car the driver's friend rather than the thing they've been fighting, which has been what what has been problematic in the opening part of the season for us. Hamilton began the year knowing 2024 would be his last season with the Silver Arrows, but was determined to finish his 11-year stint with strength. I feel the most motivated and focused I've ever been. I really, really feel... I mean, every year you come back, you're like, I'm fitter than ever, and all these different things that I generally feel I put more work and more time and more focus into preparation this year. I never thought that at this, po this point in my life that I would have hunger like I do right now. Um, and to finish on the high with the team, it, it would be a dream. You know, we've gone through a, a whole heap together. It's been an incredible ride, despite the recent results drought, with the Brits' 2013 jump from McLaren to Mercedes a calculated risk. I barely sleep last night. Um, it's, and it's quite an exciting day for us. The launch of the new car and to be new teammates with, with Nico. We were just saying how crazy it is because we used to be teammates back in 2000 when we were go karting. So it's, um, it's a dream for me to be back here as his teammate. It paid off for Hamilton in F1's turbo hybrid era with six titles over seven years before the sport's most recent technical regulation change in 2022. Race day at Silverstone will mark 945 days since Hamilton's last win. But with some upgrades and a bit of luck, that drought can be broken. Just as Russell did in Austria. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.